vocabulary. You ain't got no vocabulary, man. I graduated from Ebonics University. I got a master's and doctorate in Ebonics, dude. Ebonics, you know what I'm saying? What's your education, dude? Homeboy. Shoot. My my people got they got they got degrees and uh uh the, they got degree they got degrees and uh, all kinds of degrees. Man, you know what I'm saying? We got degrees, man. We got degrees, you got degrees, you know what I'm saying? B come before D, degrees. We got boogeries. Begrees, B E G R E E S. We black socrats, man. You aristocrat, we black socrats, man. You a hippie, we a bippy. B I P P I E, black hippie. You feel you feel me? You feel me, man? What you talking about, Willis? You see what I'm saying? You a wee waniac. I'm a waniac right here. My name is Waniac. You feel me? I'm Waniac the second. Waniac the first. Watch right here. You see what I'm saying? You don't know what you be talking. About. What you talking about, Willis? You see right here? You see right here? This right here? There. Yeah, you see? Waniac. That me right there. That Waniac. I'm Waniac the first. The second. I'm winning at the second. Like, I'm not the first. I can't be the first. This is the first right here. Wait, this winning at the first right here. You see right here? Kill him. Kill him, short. Hey, kill him, shorty. Kill him, shouty. Kill him, shouty, pimp. I don't know what you talking about. I know he talking about right here, man. We, 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 we not from the ghetto. We not from the barrios. We not from a trailer park. We from gated communities, homie. Dude, which I don't know what you talking about, Willis. What you talking about, Willis? We got dudes and dudettes in our community. K O M M U N I T Y. U N I T Y. Where you from, man? What you talking about, dude? You ain't in. You ain't in like Flynn. Where, where your where your water? Where your water? Where your super duper right here? Look at this super duper right here. Watch this, dude. Watch this, man. Watch this, Jalen. Told him I said, dude, man, man, I'm gonna go around here and spread this coronavirus. I'm gonna spread it like this, and spread it like that. You feel me? You see right here? I'm gonna spread this coronavirus. Get over here. Get me, chicken. What you scared of, chicken? What you scared of? You scared of this coronavirus? You the one that brought it to us from Japan or from China or from America. America brought the flu to the universe. The pilgrims brought all kinds of diseases. Remember the pilgrims? They brought all kinds of diseases and took the Indians out and 24 bees from Manhattan. You know, welcome to America. Nigga, I'm burying the word nigga, burying the word nigger, resurrecting the word Negro. Niggerly is actually the word. It's N-I-G-G-A-R-D-L-Y. It means cheapskate or stingy. Look up the word. Somehow it got applied to a term of endearment. Prior to that, it was like, nigger, we're going to hang you, nigger. Like, you know, like that skit with uh, Dave Chappelle. What up, Tyree McIntosh? DJ Trauma? What's happening? Remember that skit with uh, Dave Chappelle where he was a grand dragon? He was blind. Remember, like, get them niggas! Nigga! Bury the word nigga. Nigga was an attitude. Was an attitude was a concept and an expose on what officers were doing to people all around the world, starting with Compton. You know what I'm saying? Straight out of Compton. You feel me? Will Packer, what's going on? Rainforest Films. What's going on, Rob Hardy and Jay? A lot of people don't know the Jay. I'm just going to say Jay. Why? One Music Fest in Atlanta. ATL, Georgia. Check it out. The number one. one, 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 one. That's Public Enemy. No, it's O-N-E Music Fest. Google it. Go to Google University, and then you, you'll, be able to, you'll be able to find it. But yeah, man, them cats, man. You know what I mean? So we burying the word nigga, nigger, resurrecting the word negro, and look up the actual root word, which is niggardly. It's a business term. It's an adjective, definition of someone that is a cheapskate and or stingy. N-I-G-G-A-R-D-L-Y. I'm going to do like Rick Rubin did when he buried death in uh, forest lawns in Burbank. He did a procession and a burial and a whole thingy, thingy wingy he did. Like as if, you know, it was Michael Jackson being buried in, in, a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a forest lawn. I mean, he buried the word death and mausoleum and, you know, procession through the streets. Buried the word death and death jam. Remember, everybody's like, that's death. This death. So I don't know if it had anything to do with that or the fact that maybe him and Rick Russell Simmons had a falling out. And that was his way of saying, F you, dude. You know what I mean? And look at how all that came out later with uh, Russell Simmons and his boy, the actor. I mean, uh, the, the director, what's his name? Um. Jewish kid, he cool, man. That was, that was my Jewish homies. Yeah, I was born in Jewish hospital, Brookline, Beth Israel, right there, Brookline in Boston. You know what I mean? 
by Jeanette Briggs Moore and William Barry Briggs and my brother Michael Barry Briggs. He was already here four years and two months earlier than me. On June 23rd, 1966, my mom passed away, Cedar Sinai, another Jewish hospital. And then we all about Jewish hospitals, man, because we love doing business with our Jewish community and our Israeli community and our global community. We like doing business with everybody. We're relationship we're creativity and we're relationships and creativity then meets business. Feel me? David Cooper, the Cooper Group. Look them up. The Cooper Group dot net. That's T H E C O O P E R E G R O U P dot net. And look us up. Industrial Creative. That's I N D U S T R I E L hyphen or dash creative C R E A T I V E dot com. And then there's five divisions underneath that Dirt Sounds, Clear Audience, Groove Essentials, Dirt Sounds dot com. And last but not least, James Jowers. Cardinal Services, S-Corps underneath the LLC of Industrial Creative, Industrial LLC, S-Corps underneath, Peace and Chicken Grits, Yama, you know what to do, bing, bing, bing. Cherry Tang right here, Cherry Tang, r and Legends, whiteboyjames.com, GE Presents, KP, Kawan Prada, DJ BMF, Fat and Jazzy out of Florida, out of Orlando. And then this is right here. I forgot who else I'm going to have on this bill right here. Uh, BMF, oh, R&R Legends, Big Rube, uh, I'm sorry, Ronnie and Big Rube, Dungeon Family, Society of Soul, Outcast, boom, featuring on, on the Wheels of Steels, DJ FJ, Fuck Jockeys. It goes by, fuck, it's, F, it's J A U K I E, fuck jockey. A, it's DJ fuck jockey. It's DJ FJ, right here. You see Rare Features, you know, on the Wizards Field. And uh, yeah, so, and White Boy James, you know what I mean? Don't party like a rock star when you come to this party. Don't party like a rock star. Oh, oh sponsored by Waniac. Sponsored by Waniac right here. You know what I mean? Don't kill him, shoddy. You know what I mean? Sponsored by Waniac. You feel me? You know what I mean? Whip and whip right here. Whip. You know what I'm saying? You see whip right here and whip. Whip, rec, you know, whip entertainment right here. You know what I'm saying? You see that right there? Do you get the point? You see he in the middle? You see that? It looked like a, uh, it looked like a 1972. That looked like a, uh, that's definitely a Chevy Malibu right there. What I had back in the day, black in the day. It was my first car my parents bought me. My dad bought me at 15, it was 15, 14, well, I really at 14. I started driving at 15. That's a whole nother story. But I got that core. He bought it for me because I needed it. And it's a good story. And look at that whip right there. And you see that gentleman in the middle right there? That's Waniac the first. That's Waniac the second right here. You you, you get don't get it twisted, y'all. Or if you get it twisted, that's cool too. It's all good. Hey, right here. Five thousand dollars stolen motorcycle. If you have any information, please call 562-444-5073. I found this advertisement this flyer right here old school quarter page right here glossy on both sides super gloss five thousand dollar reward stolen motorcycle right here you know what i mean you know look like a custom one too that's a that's a that's a uh i mean that's a look like a chosen few bike right there man now, easy rider you know that movie was based on chosen few the brothers but there weren't enough black actors that could even fill the role so Shoot, yeah, Mr. Nicholson, Jack, yeah, Henry Fonda and all them. But right here, I found this on the ground, and I'm really trying to push this with this gentleman right here. I don't even know who he is. I never called him, but you know what I mean? So, you know, I, I know already, I already know how it is. I already lost $9,000 in bikes out here. I don't call it stolen. I said lost because I wasn't paying attention. You know what I mean? You know, it is what it is. You know, you got to take ownership of your dumbness and stupidness. So I 